What did you do and what did you find? Well, first off, we, we investigated the, uh, the, uh, the error code limitations, if you will, for, for uh, malfunction detection. Uh, these are outlined in the, in the Toyota service literature. And <clears throat> essentially, since the accelerator pedal is, is a, a prime uh, input into the vehicle's computer to, to tell the, the computer what to do as far as engine speed and that sort of thing, that was a logical place to, to start looking into investigating types of abnormalities or, or circuit faults. They have said there's absolutely no electronic problem in these cars, again and again. What we've established with, with this type of testing is that there could be a fault that could occur in these electronic systems that is not detectable by the vehicle's onboard computer. Let me put it, you're saying if, if there was this kind of fault. If there was this kind of fault, if this fault exists, it, it will never set an error code. So the computer won't recognize it? It will not recognize it. And so when they go back to look at a car... There will be no diagnostic trouble code, no problem found. So no fingerprints? No fingerprints. The problem? No fingerprints. No trail. And, and yet you can see it here as to why that is. Well, as you've seen, it, it can happen. So what, from your point of view, how, how urgent is this that they address this? I think this is a very serious issue. Why? Because um, it, for one, it happens very, very suddenly. And you can see it, this, is, this is almost an instantaneous opening of the throttle. And if, if I can duplicate that in a laboratory situation, it's possible that this could happen on its own out on the road. Does it seem to drive normally? Yeah. It's operating in a fault condition right now. It's in fault condition? Yes. Meaning. Those two accelerator sensor circuits are shorted together. So at this point, you don't have any noticeable driving characteristics that, that would indicate a fault. We're going to take off here on Koyao at uh, 20 miles an hour. Okay. Right. Okay. Oh, just like that, huh? You can. The brakes don't work. The brakes get out. Gee. This is why I'm, I'm dead serious about this. This is something that should not be able to happen. Absolutely should now, not. Now, is that an error code at this point? Not just there. Just show it to me. No Pass. error code. Pass. Pass. No error code. And yes, you'd essentially induced a short there. Absolutely. There's no DTC. There's no warning indicator lamp. There's no brake pedal override. And you induced a short. We induced a short. And that was a, I have to tell you, a very scary feeling that brakes did not work. You, well, it's you, not, the brakes were, brakes were working, but the engine, the engine has so much power, and you also have the forward momentum of the vehicle uh, such that it, it's going to take a considerable amount of stopping wow. power to, to get it shut down. I got up to, but it was, you could, I could feel it even though I knew it was coming, how difficult that was. This is a serious problem.